Razabane for IFL TV, proudly sponsored by Everlast. I'm super excited and very delighted to have with me New Zealand's finest, the number one star from New Zealand himself, Mr. Sonny Bill Williams. Sonny, firstly, uh, peace be upon you. Uh, how are we doing? Alhamdulillah, brother. Salam alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Jazakallah for that uh, intro. Um, but just here to support my brother Joe uh, and it's great to see how Andy and the boys operate. Uh, young David and Jordan's going to get out there and do their thing as well. So uh, it's been a great week just coming over to show some support and, and learn a f few things as well. Obviously you, you dominated your sport of, of rugby, rugby league uh, in, in New Zealand. Uh, you became a global star itself, yourself. That transition now, because I noticed that you're, you're trying to do some boxing. What's that transition like? And more importantly, the training aspect of it. Is it significantly different? Firstly, I did not dominate other sports. I, I, we done our best in those sports. Uh, and secondly, yes, trying to uh, get into the boxing ring again and give it a, give it a crack. Uh, I've locked in a fight for March 16th next year against Barry Hall back in Australia so inshallah that goes well but uh, you know if I'm going to do something uh, I want to learn from the best and being able to come here and see Joe do his thing uh, see how they operate see how the camps run and, um, is only going to help me I, I believe so I've got a few weeks off over this period and uh, my wife was uh, I was lucky enough my wife gave me the time uh, to get away from the kids and come over and see how it's all done but the question is, is a wife happy seeing a husband get potentially punched in the face? Well, you know, when I f finally hung up the boots, I had to have that conversation with my wife that, okay, yes, I'm, a, I'm, I'm 36 years old and uh, time's not on my side, but I said to her, why don't you, you know, do you mind if I have 24 months where I give my heart and soul to this, this sport that I've grown to love? And, you know, in the past, I've only given six months, uh, six weeks or 12 weeks to it. So I just want to see where I'm, where I'm at after 24 months of doing it. So, uh, inshallah, it all goes well. Are there certain goals and ambitions that you want to achieve, or is it just let let me do boxing? Let's see how far I can go. Yeah, I just want to try and uh, absorb as much information as I can and and do the best I can. Uh, you know, just be where my feet are and and know where I am in the sport, but also uh, leave no stone unturned in that pursuit to be the best that I can be and uh, obviously being able to come over here having that close relationship with Joe uh, helps and and in in the sense of being able to come here and just learn from him and and you know not only just support him. Joe's been here I always say to him it's like his second homie he's fought here four or five times now he loves it here he loves the atmosphere he loves the vibe loves the training um, what do you make of Joseph Parker he's a former world champion he's, he's trying to achieve that that level and that level of being a champion again um, how is he recognized back home in New Zealand he's a world-class athlete you know and he's he's in that that top bracket of heavyweights at the moment and I think from a you know avid boxing fans point of view uh, boxing's on fire especially in the heavyweight division at the moment so for Joe to represent us as Kiwis as Islanders uh, means a lot for us, you know, and he definitely can go back to the promised lands, as we call it. Uh, and you know, here he is here. Also, um, and seeing, just seeing him first, first hand up close, and and how he's, I guess, progressed or um, doing his thing, finding his feet with Andy. It's it's special to see. So he's a world class athlete, and um, I'm just grateful to be here and and see him do it first hand. And, Watch him do press ups and show off all his big <laughs> oh. muscles. <laughs> you were just saying how much of a world class athlete you are, but he said Derek Chisora knocks you out on Saturday. What are your thoughts? Listen, he would never say that. This is my brother. <laughs> this, guy, this guy looked after me in the beginning when you know when he was fighting in New Zealand. Always been a big fan and we became good, good friends now we're also so he said um, support myself, Jordan, David, you see all Oz. And it's uh, going into this fight, you know, it's just great to have this um, Unity, right? Unity going to this fight. I think I think it's important for us as not only New Zealanders as Polynesians to have strong role models like Joe is, uh, and he represents in the in the boxing ring. So I was going to say in the field, or <laughs> yeah. the boost. but you know what I mean. So it's it's a it's a it's, I'm really grateful to be here and see him do his thing and represent us. He said to us he wanted to come to the fight with Oz, and then Thursday and Friday he booked the flight. Saturday flew out. Sunday arrived. Now he's here. Joe, one question before, because I know you've got to stay warm. Um, 
he's going to take up some boxing, go to his first fight March 16th in, in Australia. Yeah, yeah. What advice do you give him? Don't give no, it. No, <laughs> no, no, real advice. Listen, no real advice. He's here. He's taking the journey to get here to support, but also to learn. And he's a fast learner. He's a student of the game and watches all video clips. I don't, I don't really watch a lot of video clips. He watches way more than me. He knows more fighters than I do. So he's a student of the game and he's just here to learn off Andy, watch the boys be be with us. You know, it's just, uh, I, I don't really have a lot of advice. I'm still learning myself. Too humble, brother. No, it's yeah. Learning, humble. Yeah, no. <laughs> <laughs> Go on, Joe, get warm. Um, Sonny, just quickly. Um, he's up against Derek Chisora. It's, uh, it's a rematch. Um, Derek's obviously a guy that always brings a great fight, always brings war. How much of a difficult fight is this going to be for Joe? Well, I think when you look at it from a, you know, I'm going to sit here and talk like I actually know boxing, but I'm talking from an avid boxing fan's point of view, but I think Joe uh, has all the attributes that he doesn't have. You know, he, he, his strengths out, outnumber uh, Derek's in all facets of the game, but uh, for me, what Joe needs to do is just go in there and be on and be ready for that fight because uh, a guy like Derek brings it and brings it every time and that's why we, want to, that's why we love watching them fight you know, and uh, really excited just to be here and support Joe and you know I'm, I think the that Joe stops him early in this fight uh, so um, but Joe just needs to be on and from what I see he's looking uh, in tremendous shape uh, you know under the guidance of Andy so uh, it's it's an exciting one. Looking forward to watching a boxing fight in Manchester Arena it's, I think there's gonna be about 13,000 people there so it's gonna be loud I'm not sure if you've been to a boxing fight or a professional boxing fight in the UK uh, but the, the UK fans bring out a great atmosphere. Yeah I've never been to a big heavyweight fight like this before so I was kind of like a a little school kid just seeing everything going on and uh, you know seeing people see, even seeing Derek for the, for the first time because I watched a lot of them it was, it was pretty cool but for me coming here and being in camp with, with young Jordan uh, with Jordan sorry and, and David uh, some up and comer cruiserweights seeing them how they operate and just their mentality Andy's mentality Joe's mentality has been pretty good and it's pretty cool so I'm really looking forward to topping that off with this fight watching this fight uh, up close and seeing the standard and the world class standard that it will be so uh, it's going to be an exciting one but I'm expecting Joe to, to do the business on, on Saturday Sonny just finally um, you've only been in the country for a few days and you've already been defeated in the ring today uh, music and cheers I haven't seen that for many years but what went wrong tonight bro uh, that, that was the most intense game I've ever played like that before you don't know what Derek's going to do but I guess Colourful characters such as uh, uh, such as himself uh, is why people love watching the sport. So I was I was only too willing to get in there and give it a crack. I thought, you know, when that when that when that other bloke got on that chair before me, I thought about giving him a little shoulder charge. But you know, hey, I got to keep it clean in here. Absolutely, Sonia. Appreciate you giving me a little bit of your time. Uh, pleasure to have you here in in Manchester supporting boxing. And yeah, enjoy the festivities of Fight Week tomorrow. Press conference Wayne Friday, and then yeah, roll on Saturday night. Jazakallah, Habib. Barakallah, Sonny Bill Williams for IFL TV. Thank you very much.